it's our last day today. Our last full day. Our last full day. Travel day tomorrow back home. Um, I think it's about quarter to one, one o'clock. The kids have gone to the park this morning because we've been packing, um, which has taken quite a bit. And still a little bit to do tomorrow. So, but um, they might as well enjoy the park because we're coming back in September anyway. So I'd rather they went out and enjoyed themselves. But um, what we're going to do, the plan is meet the kids at Universal. They're going to get a caricature done, which we, we do all the time. Every time we come with teams to get a caricature done. And then after a bit of time there, we're going to head to Cafe Tutu. Gonna head to Cafe Two Two Tango, have a nice meal there with the family, um, and then go back to Universal later on this evening when it's a bit cooler. So join us yet again. Don't go home, dear. No. Uh, it's a false smile. I, know. Oh, I really, really don't want to go home. Well, we need to see the dogs. <laughs> right, let's go find the tip tops. been good for glasses this trip sunglasses I had a pair of vans for some reason they're just cracked on me and these are just like these were spare cheap ones and they've literally started melting I'm getting, been getting like black bits all on the side of your head haven't you yeah it's just like the rubber's been coming off and so I'm gonna have to invest in some well I'll say after I don't want to pay too much for sunglasses now I'm on my second pair this trip as well aren't I? yeah so but I'm probably going to get some foster grants or something like that for this summer. I'm just writing real small letters back then. Um... Oh, Ray-Ban. Ray-Ban. Yeah, just in white marker. Ten, yeah, ten. I, can, I can pretend to be a cool kid. But no, I don't think it... I mean, I'm not knocking it, but I don't want to spend that much money on something that I might end up losing, to be totally honest with you. Or put it in the washing machine. Oh, put, the last lot of Ray-Bans I had, she put in a washing machine. I was gutted. Literally just gone to the toilet for five minutes. No sign of Sarah. Do when you've got suspicion. A very strong suspicion. No, I could be wrong. But um not sure. Am I wrong? Am I wrong? Yeah, do you know something? I could have misjudged her. Quite possibly. I think I. There. I knew it. Just got a t shirt, I like. Can I show you it? Yeah. Hang on. Let's see I this t shirt. Get that. Oh, yeah, I've seen that. Yeah, body bad off. Yeah. <laughs> that can, like, cover my beef belly. <laughs> hey, we're going jogging when we get back. Are we? We definitely are. We're going to get in shape for the next trip. Only if these sunglasses will melt the Polaroid, polarized. You are adorable at that. Very good, it's a video. Oh, oh, welcome to Hollywood, everybody. Where are you from? England. And if you need a taxi back to England, call Lambie the Cabbie, that's me. Will do, definitely. Are we gonna ship that to England, though? Yes, yes. Really? I think we could float it. Could do, yeah. Across the pond, as it were. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> Any adorable people? Yeah, have a great day, you guys. First time meeting you. So Thank, thank you. you. Have a good day. Bye. Bye. <laughs> that was good. Have you shown everyone the new Mini and Lab side? Yeah, I've shown them. But I'll show them again. I do like that, that is cool. And then they've taken a lot of footage down from. Yeah. Will this be ready when we come in September then? That's, gonna, that's opening soon, this one. <laughs> it's summer, so it should be. Yeah, hopefully. I can say I'm not sure, looking at the menu of what they had, I'm not sure I fancy it because it was all like blue stuff and it, like 
really strange oh, concoction. Yeah, but whether that's like I said, whether that's just a first time Guinea, them they won't sell a lot of it. I don't think it, it's going to have to sell normal food. Got the fire hydrant going again. Right, so the last message we got, the kids are over there somewhere. So that is where we're heading. Made it to Duff and I can see the kids, I need to sit down. Seems really humid today. <laughs> so it's a Duff light and a pretzel with a beer cheese. Again, from Duff. The kids off at Salty Sketches. So she's just started the process. Now Sarah and I are going to leave, go and have a drink and pop back a bit later on and see how they've got on. There's a few people on the last vlog that we did had mentioned what is it Sarah's wearing round her neck. So what that is, it's uh, called a frog tog. And you get that basically what you do is you, you just soak it in water, wring, rinse it out, wring it out a little bit, and it keeps cool for absolutely ages. It just takes that little bit of hotness off your neck, doesn't it? I bought this in Walmart for about five dollars about ten years ago. And it's lasted. And we've lost one, haven't we? Yeah. And I've bought others, but they've not been quite as good. But this has been, it, it does work. Yeah, you see, I don't, I've got the spray. I just put cooling spray on my neck because I don't like wearing that because I think it... I don't like anything round my neck and I think it makes you look ridiculous. I don't mind looking ridiculous. <laughs> as long as you're cool. But yeah, frog togs. So, probably worth looking at if you do suffer from the heat in Florida or anywhere else you go. So now we're going to have a quick drink at Shea Alcatraz. So we've just paid Meth another visit um, and this time we've gone for the escapes, the, the escapes and Meth has very kindly put a shark in for us. I got two! She got so two. Stuck together. Yeah, so I got two. I've Have you had a drink of that? Me. What do you think of that? I quite like it actually. That's got whiskey and Spiced rum. rum. Um, sweet and sour mix top of coke. There's something else in it I can't remember now. That's the first time I've had that. It's yeah. Nice. yeah, I haven't had this before. Let's have a... Oh, that's nice. That's nice. I like the single rider though. Yeah, the single rider is, like I've said before on the other vlog, it's um, a, a secret drink. You've got to ask for it. It's not advertised. Um, that's got Southern Comfort and Amaretto. Yeah, it reminds me of that other drink that you like drinking. The whiskey based, the bourbon based. Godfather? No. Can't think what it was. Can't think what that one is. But that's, that's probably... I prefer an ocean attack to that, but it's a very close second. Is it means it really humid today. I think it's the first day that I've really yeah. felt like I've struggled. It's a bit of a breeze still. I've had a bit of a breeze most of the time. I've been here, but yeah, it's more humid. I'm glad I've got these uh, microphone muffs. Dead cats. Because it has been a bit breezy. So I'm hoping they're working. I'm hoping you're not hearing any, any wind. Unless it's coming from Sarah. Was that your impression of wind? Yeah, you start doing that. Yeah, maybe not. <laughs> right, the kids' pics have all done, which we'll they've put them away, so we'll show you them when we get in the room. So I think we've got about four or five of the 
pictures now that we get done every time we come. Got it out the tube, look. Yeah, that is so cool. Yeah, like that. We've actually bitten the bullet and we've just bought a bar of the chocolate bacon bar. Milk chocolate with bacon bits. Could have seen it. I'm not sure, but it's worth trying, isn't it? Amy hasn't done Fast and Furious yet, so we just went to have a look and it's 55 minutes so she's not bothering I don't think it's worth a 55 minute wait especially after you've been on Kong which is a lot better ride but these guys are out it's not far off of what I do at work all day I've never been a big fan of Starbucks that much, but I've discovered the new chocolate mint, uh, chocolate java mint frappuccino, and they're absolutely gorgeous. Or do I have the caramel ribbon crunch? No, I'll stick what I know. Caramel's quite nice, I think. Is it? Yeah, we've just done the mummy. It was great as ever. The only scary bit was the lad, there's a group of lads about four people in, five people in front of us, and one of them had puked all up the metal steps and then ran downstairs. So everybody, including us, are crawling under the barrier to go into the fast pass area to get away from the vomit so you've got all the fast pass people kicking off then we crawls back into our lane and everybody's barking which was bad enough and then bugger me the lad suddenly runs past us trying to get in the car with his rest of his mates who had already gone and he gets in front of us in the car so me, Sarah and Amy, just, we're not doing it. We get us out, says to the chap, we'll go on the next ride. And as that roller coaster car shut off, he looked so ill, he was going to puke again. So that was the scariest part about the mummy, the vomit. Vomit boy. Still doing the face, yeah, to the New York Public Library. So they're coming on with it. And that's a bit where Whiprad Rocket shoots out the building. Yeah. Yeah. I did see this online a few months ago. That looked really cool in the back. It's thirty-two dollars, and it makes sounds and lights up. And lights up. Let's go show it to the boss. The boss run away. I'll go find the boss. Oh, uh, that? Yeah. They showed that on the vlog or something, didn't they? What's it do? I think he's. it'll make motorcycle noises. And I reckon the headlight lights up. Or should we get it next time because we've got yeah. that much stuff in the suitcase now? Yeah, we get it next time. Yeah. We can go carry on. Yeah, we've put more mates than we thought we would. We'll say we, Amy's bought loads of stuff. But uh, we've more or less packed two suitcases with, with merch. Bags and shirts and various other things like that. That's you can't cute. take that back with us though. Why? You can't take snow globes on the plane because they explode. I've managed to dodge going on that monstrosity. They forgot about it. So I haven't been for... Oh, no. It's about too soon. I hate it. I'd rather go on that Dr. Zeus trolley ride. <sighs> Yeah. 
not one for plushies myself, but that is so cute. You need to take them out. Oh yeah. Cute is that? How much is that? Thirty dollars. It'd be nice if we do the cruise next year, Sarah. For the cruise, just sat on the balcony with a glass of champagne, winds blowing through your hair, me serenading you. I am sailing. Dulcet tones. I am sailing home again. Across the sea, I've got one miserable family. Charming. First time we've been in here. Just going to go and have a drink at the bar. Yeah. Go on, let's go for a beverage. Keeps going giggity giggity. Landing. I must admit, in my opinion, they need to bulldoze this and do something with it a little bit better. It's, it's outdated. It's awful. Oh, get that for the dogs. Cute. Oh. Is that a cap? Oh, it's, what do you put that on an hamster? <laughs> what do you put that on? Your pet rat. Leave this 
people actually queuing for it. I really can't believe we've queued for this. I can't believe there's a queue for this. My God! Ten minutes been about an hour! Yay! We've just done Jurassic Park River Adventure. It was good, I think the only criticism with that is hardly any animatronics, a lot of them weren't working. Um, you had the space and they're just not there. And then, oh, they were covered off in like a green mesh. So, but it was this good. I've got, I think, I think they're gonna revamp that, definitely. Well, they are gonna revamp it, aren't they? Yeah, because um, I think that's why, not, why they're not repairing the animatronics, because, What's the point? So I'm expecting that to have a closure probably at the end of summer. It was Amy's first time on it though, and I think she liked it. It wasn't the drop she was worried about, no, it was a T-Rex. Really Sorry. I've got really weird phobia of like large animatronics. It makes me uncomfortable. So uh, one going about in a dark room about to come to you freaked me out, but I was fine. It wasn't that bad. Right, I think we're doing Spider-Man and we're not going to do um, Cafe 2-2 Tango. The kids said they'd like to do Long Owns again, which is fine with me. Sarah and I will definitely be doing Cafe 2-2 Tango a couple of times when we come back, so... So I think it's... You want to go to Spider-Man, don't you know? Uh, yeah, yeah. We did. I've not been on it since I've been here. Well, oh, we'll do Spider Man. You got to go on it. Right, the kids have just gone on to Spider Man. Sarah's just taking a skid on some. Uh, there's a bit of an incline, and it's where they pump water from these like jets for the kids to play in. And she's just taking a bit of a spill. I think you've hurt your wrist more than anything, aren't you? Yeah. But she's all right. I've got on my toes and my finger as well. Have you? Yeah. I'm fine though. Yeah, she's alright, but a bit of a graze. It's all red there, isn't it? I know, it is red. Yeah, Sarah's just gone to first aid to get that cleaned because you don't know really what was in that water. So I'm just going to wait for the kids and then we're going to meet her at the first aid area. But not bad going, the first little accident of the holiday. The mass exodus out the park. I think we're just gonna head back to the room, freshen up a little bit, and then off to Longhorns. But it's been a, considering me and Sarah didn't really come out till about half 12 and meet the kids, it's been quite a long day, I think it's about I think it's about eight o'clock-ish now, maybe a bit late. It'll be eight o'clock, park's just closed. But a little bit tired. again it's the way he says it look I almost it in your mouth have they got ch chowder? yeah chowder 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 you having chowder? <laughs> no my face is sad how do you get the chowder? Oh, it's lobster chowder chowder oh, it's got turtles in it 
<laughs> I'm going to have the mac and cheese. That was another fantastic meal at Longhorns and we had a fantastic server who we call Rex because she said about her short arms and she did have short arms but she was lovely. So now we're heading back to the room and getting ready for the journey home tomorrow which we're not looking forward to but right gonna end today's vlog here the last full day of our holiday we've had a like I said earlier we had a lovely meal again at Steakhouse if you haven't tried the Longhorns try it there is another one and um, salt grass or something somebody mentioned which is supposed to be really good so I might try that next time so tomorrow we're up uh, I think we're getting picked up about half past one with the transfer coach to Melbourne Airport we're supposed to fly I think it's about half six so join us tomorrow for travel day hopefully we do no delays or anything so thank you for watching we appreciate your support please subscribe like and comment see you tomorrow